Growing up in Ithaca, New York, way upstate New York, away from New York City, I used to think that if I wanted to experience nature or see nature, I had to drive a couple of hours outside of town to some very remote forest or wade in some stream. I really thought nature was where people are not. But of course, that's not true. All of us live embedded in communities of plants and animals and weather, no matter where we are in the world, whether we're in an apartment building or a house or out on a farm, there is life all around us. I'm Lindy Elkins-Tanton. I'm a planetary scientist at Arizona State University, and I'm really interested in the way we observe and interact with the world around us. This collection of videos shows the ways that we are embedded together with animals and plants and insects and with the weather all the time, no matter where we are, and how you can learn to observe and recognize and even identify the plants and animals and the insects wherever you are in your own life. I think that you may find the way I have, that if you focus on the natural world around you, even if it's a tiny plant in a tiny garden next to a tiny door that, that comes out of your building, or if you can go out into some place that is filled with plants and animals, if you focus very closely, it'll bring you these moments of joy. And so no matter what is happening in the world around us or in our lives, there's something about the perspective of watching the cactus in the yard change through the year or recognize when a new bird comes back in the spring that brings that little surge of hope and joy and connection with our world that really we all need.